the thing is what I needed when I was small is what me what me and Chantal created with the sun kids. I that's what I needed. So when I met Chantal and she was like um showing me her book or that the, the the chapters that she wanted to do. I was like, oh my goodness, this is what I need in my life. So creating this book, all about going back to yourself. How does energy work? God, God's messengers, angels, fairies, um, how to grow your own crops and yeah. and how to, you know, everything, everything was in this book. And I was just like, this is what I was needing. If I knew this when I was small, I would have known how to handle a lot of things. But I had to figure out myself, you know. And um, so, yes, the sun kids is exactly what I wanted. And it would have made my life so much easier. Um, but I, that's why I came here to create with Chantal, this, I mean, I was about to fun. say, I mean, think about that. If you had not gone through childhood trauma, you yeah. would be able to help facilitate this for other children at this moment. You know, yeah, so you. I'm going to put... Why is yours white? It should be like beautiful blue. It's, it's like... probably my old ass laptop. <laughs> yeah, it's um, like... <laughs> it, I actually just got morning. I don't know if I told you this. So I was sitting here the other day morning. I've told this to our audience and I was like, my laptop is so old. It was never meant for YouTube. And I was processing a video and it was taking forever. And I was like, my computer is about to die. And I just got died. And I just said to universe, if you want me to continue doing this, I need to figure out a way to get a new computer. And the very next day, the very next day, I kid you not, one of the students at Ashtanga Yoga Atlanta, whose brother works as in the music industry, so has a lot, has have a lot of space on his computer, was giving away a brand new desktop with all this space because his company was getting in the computer. So it's actually sitting, it just got here. It's huge. It's sitting in the other room. After I get done no. filming today, I'm going to set it up. So ask and you shall receive, mm. seek and you shall find, knock and the door shall be open unto you. I literally, not even 24 hours, had literally said, I need, if you want me to continue making these videos, I need a way to get a new computer. And I literally, boom, there it is. And so. Yeah. Don't think wow, that awesome. miracles don't exist. So yeah. it probably looks a lot more fancy on your laptop, guys. So um, I will put the Sun Kids um, website down in the description box below, both on YouTube and yeah. on Google. You know, the Sun Kids is all about that because you know that abandonment that we spoke about, that feeling yeah. of the separateness, the separate separateness. <laughs> I love this this word. Anyway, so so when you put your kid into a daycare, it's like you really experience that separateness. But with the Sun Kids, we teach you about energy. How do you connect? Animal communication. If you can communicate with your dog, you can communicate with your kid, you know. <laughs> but anyway, so it's about if you can tell your child this is what's happening, then it's a lot less traumatizing. So you can avoid a lot of childhood trauma by doing little things. And I don't even know you guys had a YouTube channel specifically. Yeah, we started it. with it. Yeah, we started with it. I just subscribe, so I'm going to put that up in the description box to you guys, so that you can. Awesome, yeah. You can even if you're not going to be a facilitator, go to their channel, subscribe yeah, to their channel. Yeah, we're planning on doing some cool kitties um, um, videos, like creating little unicorn horns and stuff like that. So, like fun stuff for the kids on YouTube. Yeah. And and that's amazing. I wish I had had something like this too when I was a kid. Um, uh, you should, the, the the activities when you do the teachers training, then you get all the manuals. There's such fun activities, coloring in things, gardening <laughs> stuff. It's it's really amazing. It, I, I did the best thing in my life. Well, that's I'm going to put this down, I'm, guys. In I'm the sun kids on steroids. Yeah. I'm the first sun kid. <laughs> When's the next workshop for um for kids to join? When's the next date you guys are doing? A uh, we finished this year. We finished our last one now. But about, like, let's say next week, there's going to be a new tab that's going to say for kids. 
and there will be nine workshops for kids that they can do anything from animal communication energy um, and everything like that so december we'll have our kiddies part of the website up and running so then you guys can your kids can do the um the workshops we've got some nine very awesome even the bullying how to deal with bullying it's an amazing workshop so it will be live in the next week well once it's live let's show shoot me a text let me know and i'm gonna bring you in shanti back on my channel and we'll do a whole in-depth breakdown maybe like a part two of what's coming up for sun kids and all that kind of stuff uh, so um for the next year yeah. because let's i mean these kids are coming in already pretty cool and pretty evolved yeah, exactly it's like if i mean just meditation if i knew how to if, if i had meditation classes when i was like four five six years old yeah i would have been a diff i would have dealt with my shit. sorry a lot better uh, yeah, I could have avoided. I could have avoided a lot of stuff. <laughs> My grandmama did try to teach me to, to meditate when I was about eight, but uh, <laughs> that didn't. That didn't. It didn't stick until years later when I went to India. But uh, you know, and and it, it's talking to me culturally too. She, My grandmother was like one of the only people in the state of Georgia who was meditating at that time because you didn't do that, and so culturally I wasn't used to it. But um. You know for sure guys well let me know guys watching right now if you have any questions regarding uh, uh hopefully this episode is going to help a lot of people um Morne and shanti are very much participants in the challenges that we're doing we just wrapped up the 30-day challenge we're going to be doing i'm going to actually be linking this episode in this once it'll be on my channel for a while but once the 60-day challenge starts i'm going to be linking this episode back when we go through back uh back through childhood trauma again this is one of these episodes i feel like some of these um, things that we do, not just us, but other healers do, it's something to re-listen to over and over and over and over and over again um, to help you in your process. Because we are, we we all are just those little boys and those little girls, which is bigger yeah. bodies now. Because that's the thing is childhood trauma. It's trauma. Trauma. It's yeah. trauma. Yeah. yeah. So, well, we love you guys so much. Once again, I'm going to have all of the links for Aquarius Rising. If you guys are living under a rock and don't know who Aquarius Rising Africa is, I'm going to have those links in there as well as solutions with Aquarius Rising Africa and all the Sun Kids stuff um, down, down in the description box below so you guys can start your journey off if you're just starting your journey or if you've been on this journey for a while and you want to facilitate new modalities of healing, go ahead and check them out. And I guess I'll be seeing you again on Monday, won't I? Yes, of course. It is. <laughs> is it ML tablet ML number tablet. four? Yes, yeah, so oh, we're, no, we're still in the third tablet. It's gonna take us a while to get to that. 3.2 yeah 3 or 3.3 <laughs> at this point it's gonna take us a while to get through that third tablet because like every verse is very important yeah, so, amazing, so yeah. yes looking forward to that and uh, me too you guys. bye guys talk to y'all soon bye. <laughs>